Yeah, I mean, I, he's probably thinking, okay, happy days. Oh, that's quality from the Hetchka. Match after match, which you often see in 250s. But his intensity was pretty good at that point. Yeah, good old court tennis. So that's got to be working well, but also he's got to take the opportunities when he can to stop his opponent from attacking. Which is, it kind of felt yesterday in the first set and a half, that was what he was doing brilliantly. Yeah. Fifteen or I don't know. Jakob Mensik, only 17, 191 in the world right now. Mention the fact that he's coached by Birdie. Lehetska who strikes first in this final. When he broke, he could not back the break up. Tennis kind of like that, though, and Lehetska won't have that problem. And again, Byers with a chance to try and get Lehetska on the stretch or struggling a little bit, but. The attempted pass was straight at Lehechka, who dealt with the volley superbly. Which he's doing more than Bias, 34% to, to 18%, but he's converting those attacking positions into winning ones. There's a chance. Finally is able to get the break straight back. Big ball striking. This time, he can punch a hole through Lehetska from the back. And this time, it is out wide again. Far too much height on the drop shot. And with the speed of Baez, that's easy pickings for the Argentine. Got him again. And Baez's hot streak continues. Certainly not at the level of Baez's. Again, Baez. Love 15. Loose there from Bias. That's 
one way to save the first of three break points. Excellent serving. <laughs> Built the point beautifully. Well, a tough opening set. Six games before. But as so many sets have done this week, it goes the way of Sebastian Baez. Another gutsy performance from the Argentine, and he's a set away from what he hopes to be back-to-back -back ATP Tour titles. Needs to be 30 or 26. To be 26, needs to win the next two sets. Delay between the, the sets. Mahatka unfazed if that point is anything to go by. Um, volley, we're talking about how effective it's been. Game yes, he can. Phenomenal strike off the backhand, and Lehetska breaks early in set two. Class Dennis from Bias. Oh, he's yeah, missed man. that one as well. Hedgeco getting that early break, went 3 1 up. Oh, that's glorious. A simply sublime backhand because he was under real pressure there by it. It's just awesome. Brilliant overhead, and it's three games in a row for Sebastian Baez as he breaks again. There always is a way back, of course, winning a title's big for any player. But he can do no wrong right now, Sebastian Baez, on fire. Or Radvansky, he's one or the other. Time a little short, and Hetzka stepping up. Yeah, it's certainly helping Hetzka out, and smart serve. A little bit of pace off, but plenty of top spin to. Bouncing on that one. Deuce. Wow.
Yeah, he's got him this time. It's back-to-back -back ATP so Tour two, titles six, for Sebastian four, Baez. Six, three. What a week for the Argentine. It's now 10 match wins in a row, but more importantly, here's the Winston-Salem Open champion. A superb performance. He was rock-solid from the back. Had to recover from a breakdown in both set one and set two, but displayed the type of character and guts we have seen all week to win what is his fourth ATP Tour title. Sheer delight. As you say, he's still got many years to come, and it's good that he's not only winning on clay courts, he's winning on hard courts.